everyone at 1995 here in the video game fan fiction plot with a new chapter for you all of Rock of Steel I do hope you enjoy it and remember I do not own the Transformers Prime series or any music within this video and I give full credit to its author Haley Moss on Wattpad. Chapter 7 Speed Metal LPOV Today was like any other day I got up and did my normals and went to school. Magnus said that RC would be taking me to base today since he would be searching for Energon today. School just got out and both Jack and I got on to RC. Darby, Blaze. Oh great it's Vince again. Look Vince I'm really not in the mood for kicking your sorry can today. I told him. He was steaming. He got into his car and drove off. Akree was at a stoplight when Vince pulled up and said so let's settle this in a race but I bet you can't up with that ugly scooter. Vince said. Vince drive off then. RC you're not gonna let him diss you like that are you? I asked. It's against the rules but that's personal. RC said before driving past Vince. Okay first past that wins. Vince said pointed to a hug castus in front of us. A girl named Sierra that I could tell Jack licked said one, two, three, and go. Vince raced past us. RC falling behind. RC the point of the race is to win. Jack said. Jack when you win you want it to really sink in. Akri said before she sped up and raced on way past Vince. She even reared up to where she was racing on her back wheel. Awesome. We left Vince in the dust and through entrance of the base. We both got off and let RC transform. This was a one-time deal, no telling anyone about this, especially Optimus. She said. What are you talking about? Jack said. What he said. I said. Exactly. She said. Dude y'all totally beat that bully. Michael said. Michael how'd you find out? Jack asked. You're serious? Michael said. You can't tell anyone especially Optimus. I told her. And at that time I saw Raph too. He nodded his head. I walked over to B and tapped on his peed. He looked down at me and said hi Ella. I smiled and said hey you wanna go for a drive? I asked. He whirled and said heck yeah. He transformed and I ate traff hey you want to go for a drive? No y'all go ahead I have homework to do. Raf said. Okay see you later. I hoped into the driver's seat of B's car. So awesome I love his car. I can't wait to see what vehicle that wheel Jack chooses. It will prob awesome. We drive out of the base and get on a dire road where no cars were passing. Hey B can I drive? I asked. I was fixing to show him my driving skills. Surely it will be easy to drift in his car. Like a go-kart right? Ha <laughs> ha. Sure. B said. Okay don't freak out but whatever you do don't take control. I told him. Oh dot dot okay B said nervously. Do you trust me? I asked. Yes B said. I grabbed his steering wheel and pressed all the way down on the gas. The car sped forward as fast as it would go making dust fly everywhere. I saw that B had an emergency brake, this is going to be so great. I kept my foot on the gas pedal then I turned the wheel to the left and lightly pressed on the brake and pulled the emergency brake and drifted in a circles doing a donut. Then I put the emergency brake back to where it was. I pressed on the brake to where we stopped. Dust flew all around us like a tornado. Whoa how'd you learn how to do that? B asked. A movie called Toy Go Drift which what I was doing, we'll watch it sometime you'll like it. I practice using go-karts. I told him. But that was by far the best ever. First time using a car. Awesome. B said. Hey kid what were you doing there? That was pretty cool as the human kids say. A voice I know as Wheeljack said dot two. I roll down B's window and say hey Wheeljack. Nice car. When did you get back? I asked. Hey kid, just today and thanks scanning this car before heading off to base. Wheeljack said. Ella did that what do you call it Ella? B asked. It's called drifting and a donut. I said. Wheel maybe you can teach me how to do that? Wheeljack asked. It would be an honor to teach a wrecker like yourself. I said. Let's get back to base to see what the others are doing. B said. Yeah okay but this was so fun. I said. Next time kid I'll take you and you can drive me. 
Wheeljack said. I couldn't help it I laughed. What's so funny? Wheeljack asked confused. It just sounded dirty the way you said it like you wanted us to um dot 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 interface. I said. Us what? Wheeljack said. Yeah when you say it like that it's human humor to us like if something sounds dirty we'll say that's what he said or she said. It's pretty funny. I told him. He just humped. We drove back to the base. Magnus still want back. Ratchet, RC, or Optimus must be in their rooms. Jackie. Bulkhead yelled and hugged Wheeljack. Watch the paint job, I just scanned a car. Wheeljack said. Hey Raf can I borrow Bumblebee for a few hours? Jack asked. Ello you have to come too. Jack said. Jack you know racing is against the rules what if Optimus found out? Raf said. But they have to beat the bully again. Michael said. Raf still won't convinced. And get the girl. Michael added. Raf said okay and that they would stall as long as they could. So where are y'all headed? Wheeljack asked. Racing Aganis to guy who is always picking on us. I told him. You want to come? Be my awesome ride? I asked. Oh yeah we gonna smoke him. Wheeljack said then transformed into his car. I got into the driver's seat and we drove to the racing place we were supposed to meet Vince at. Both Wheeljack and B pulled up on either side of Vince's car. Vince was like where did y'all get those at least that's what his face said. Jack said bikes in the shop. So just let me do the driving okay? I said to Wheeljack. Okay you're the boss. Wheeljack said. I laughed. Sierra stood in front of all the drivers with a hanky above her head. She let the hanky drop and I pressed on Wheeljack's gas pedal. It was B, then Wheeljack, then Vince and the other cars. I looked into the rearview mirror and saw a car ram into the side of Vince's car. Shorty I hate to take control when you're doing an awesome job but the car behind us is knockout. Wheeljack said. I let my hands go of the wheel and said you're in charge dude. Ultra Magnus POV. The while that I had been gone I had not found any inner gone. I was glad to be back at base. I walked to the main hangar where I saw Miko and Raphael playing a game with Bulkhead watching. And I wonder where Ella is. A Cree came in the main hangar also. Have you seen Jack RC asked. Yes have you seen Ella also? I asked. Not since the last time we saw them. Michael said nervously. They're racing aren't they? A Cree said. Racing? It's Aganis Optimus's rules. I said. Wheel you know Jackie doesn't follow rules. Bulkhead said. Wheel Jack and Bumblebee went? A Cree yelled. Yeah Jack was gonna race B and Ella was gonna race Wheel Jack. Michael said. Did you know about this? RC asked Bulkhead. No he said. Then he said maybe a little. Just this once. Raphael said. The screen the wind off it was Bumblebee. You're being chased by knockout? Raphael said. That sounds like a Decepticon. Michael said. B do not engage, your priority is to keep Jack safe, until I get my hands on him, tell Wheel Jack to do the same. R.C. told our young scout. Tell Wheeljack are you serious? B said. If Wheeljack puts my Ella in danger I will wreck his aft all the way through space. Ella POV. We need to lose this con and fast. Wheeljack we need to go faster so we can hide before he sees us. I told Wheeljack. You got it boss. Wheeljack said. I would have laughed if this weren't a serious moment. I saw B go up a ramp, follow B. I told Wheeljack. We sped up the ramp and into the air just like B did. I saw B hide under a bridge. We drove and hid behind an old gas station. Whatever you do Wheeljack don't blast anything around here, remember last time? I said. Yes ma'am. We stayed there and waited until we heard B honk his horn twice, then we arrived by them. Can't you just honk once for bad news and honk twice for good news? Jack said. B honked his horn two times. I turned and saw C, Bulkhead, and Magnus. Oh boy I am in so much trouble and will be if Optimus finds out. I opened Wheeljack's door and got out. Jack we need to have a little chat. RC said. So do we Ella. Magnus said. Later Vince got snatched by that sports car con. 
Jack said. What would knock out what with a human? R.C. asked. I don't he promised took him for Bumble's human friend I am not even Bumblebee's human friend Jack said. It's doesn't matter why he took him Vince is in trouble. I said. Oh tough break for Vince. Bulkhead said. Bulkhead. Both Jack and I said at the same time. What I hear that guy is a jerk, and he's the one who hit you Ella. Bulkhead said. No argument there but the guy is also innocent. Jack said. Vince doesn't deserve to get crushed by cons. I said. Hope on Jack RC said as she transformed into her motorbike, Jack got on. Ella get in. Magnus told me as he transformed. I could see Wheel Jack was still in his car form so I ran back over towards him. Ah uh, you know I think I'll ride with Wheel Jack for now. I said as I hopped into the driver's seat and we drove off. You scared of the LA captain? We Eel Jack asked. No just afraid of the wrath I haven't seen him get angry yet and I would rather not see it quite so soon. I told him. As we were driving I decided to ask a question I know I wouldn't be liking the answer to the question. How long are you staying for this time? Just a few more days but you know I'll always be back and you can call me anytime you want, plus I'll be there if you need me kid. Wheeljack said. I smiled and said thanks Wheeljack. We drove till the others stopped when Jack said. Remember no shooting. We drove past them when I saw RC let Jack off. A wheel Jack Sheldon you let me out? I asked. Do you get car seat? He asked. No I am not like Micah thankfully. I told him. Then you will be safe in my chest compartment when I transform. He said. Oh wow this is gonna be so great. Okay. You just bring the rain. I told him. He laughed at what us humans say when it's time to kick some butt. I saw him transform then it was just all black. I braced myself in his small chest compartment. I then felt him getting hit by something hard, which made me tilt. I could hear what sounded like swords hitting metal. Then I heard two tires screeched and then silence. Wheel Jack where is Ella? I heard Magnus ask. Calm down she's fine. Wheel Jack said. There was an opening of his chest compartment, I climbed up and poked my head out. What I saw made me want to shrink by down in there, Magnus' face was fuming. Maybe at me, maybe at Wheeljack, maybe at both I don't know and I don't want to find out. So what con was it this time besides knockout? I asked. Breakdown. Wheeljack said. Oh so it was ugly again, did you make it rain? I asked Wheeljack. Yeah kid I made it rain or wheel we did. We eel Jack said. Wheel Jack then transformed back into his car and let me out. I ran over to Magnus and got into his passenger seat. We drove to where Optimus was. Optimus this was my fault. Jack said. It was also mine as wheel since I went also. I said. I want going to let Jack take all the fall. We must get this boy to safety, explanations can come later. From all of you. Optimus said. Everyone just let their heads fall except B and Magnus since they were in their vehicle forms. Magnus and I drove in silence all the way home. I knew he was mad at me. I was just wanting for him to scold me but he never did, maybe he was too mad. We arrived at my house and I just got out without a word to Magnus. I was actually hoping he would at least say goodnight but he didn't. I didn't pat at his hood I just walked into my house. I went upstairs and took a shower. Then got on my PJs and went to bed. I laid in bed for a while thinking of what I could say to Mangus tomorrow. I know I have to apologize to him, to Wheeljack for also getting him into trouble, and I also have to apologize to Optimus for breaking the rules. Tomorrow is going to be an eventfully long day. I soon feel asleep hopefully to dream about saving the earth from the cons. Well that's the ending of that chapter, I do hope you enjoy this video if you like to see more remember, to hit that like button subscribe to this channel and leave a comment down below until next time.